2006, longtime bartender Bob Isaacson purchased Molly Malone's. The first time I walked into a bar, it was magical. I tried to get a bartending job from the second I turned 21. That's all I wanted to do. Kamikazes, anybody? I wanted to buy Molly's because I didn't think everybody else was doing it right, and I thought I could do it better. Lacking the finances, Bob convinced his parents to cash in $350,000 of their retirement to buy the bar. This is my first real serious venture, and the first year we made a $700 profit, but that went into an employee Christmas party, so we ended up with a loss. Struggling to make the transition from bartender to bar owner, Bob was unable to make Molly Malone's profitable. I got 15 grand in payroll coming out. That's going to be a problem. It's going to be a losing day. There's um, Joe's, and then I'll get Bobby's right now. Seeking additional help, Bob hired his girlfriend, Rain, to manage the bar. I've been dating Bob for the last seven years. And because the bar's failing, I just see his attitude going on a downward slope. Whose tabs are those going on? Are you even asking, or are you just giving away? <laughs> When things don't work the way you plan, it gets extremely frustrating, and it can take your motivation level down severely. I'm trying to get this bar under control right now, and you are doing nothing. Rain, taking on so much of the management responsibilities puts a lot of strain on our relationship. It's hard to find moments where we're just doing something for us. I'm dealing with stress in a weird way. Just bear with me. As Bob and Rain's relationship soured, Sales continued to plummet, and the staff began to take their frustrations out on each other. Your customers are complaining. Aren't you behind the bar? How are they my customers? You really need to be doing something a little bit more than you are. I do. I don't know what you want me to do. Huh? OK. OK. I, these are your girls, dude. Like, what the, what the hell? With a dysfunctional staff and a lack of leadership, Molly Malone's is now losing $6,000 a month. Keep her the away from me. I will. Right now. Calm I'm down. She's nowhere near. Calm down. I have reached a breaking point working here. This bar has caused a great amount of stress on my family. Love you. Love you. My son Damien, he was starting to get anxiety, and I'm supposed to protect him and be his mom. And because of this bar, I wasn't there for him when he needed me. You know, we love each other, but in order for me to marry Rain, we need to lose a lot of the stress of operating this business. When the bar goes under, I, I'm not going to be able to provide for you and Damien. Longevity is in the relationship, not in the business. I feel like I'm not enough, you know? Unable to move their relationship forward and fearing for their financial future, Bob and Rain have agreed to pull back the doors, bust open the books to make a call for help to Bar Rescue. I can't put my future and Damien's future in your hands anymore if you don't wake up and listen to John and take care of this bar, I'm leaving you.